We're here at Louisville switching truck sales today in uh, Riverport, Louisville, Kentucky. And uh, they are doing uh, one of their first um, installations of Instachain automatic ice chains. And uh, it is on a uh, it's an, uh, fire department vehicle, emergency vehicle. Might not look, to, look like one to you guys, but it's a rural area. And uh, so with this truck and then a possible pumper truck they're going to be doing. And uh, anyway, Butch with Louisville Switching is uh, kind of checking things out. Corey's underneath uh, doing some of the installation. You'll hear him in a second here. It'll get loud, but uh, they've got uh, all the parts laid out here uh, going through, and then uh, that, and then uh, they've got support from the uh, manufacturer, Instachain out in Utah, on the uh, phone as far as uh, walking through any questions on the installation. But uh, Anyway, Butch, I've just been kind of filling them in on uh, this is uh, one of the first inst chain installations you guys have done since becoming a dealer. I told him it was going to get loud too, so. But uh, anything you want to kind of add to the. Well, this is actually from one of our uh, rural fire departments here in. Uh, uh, it's located out in Meade County, and they had a tanker that they had recently purchased that they wanted to outfit with a uh, 12 strand. Uh, chain wheels from the instant chain line, so uh, we brought it into our shop. Um, uh, Phil, Chuck and I went out to their fire department, did the measurements on the VSI form, and uh, we ordered the specific uh, uh, mounting kit that they needed for this instant chain line on this truck, and uh, we brought the truck into the shop, and Corey's uh, doing the installation this morning. The uh, chains arrived this past week, like I said, it's a 12-strand chain wheel set, and uh, looks 